Number 10 has moved to clarify after confusion and accusations emerged in light of the Prime Minister's claim his uncle was torpedoed in the Falklands War. Number 10 have been forced to clarify a claim made by Sir Keir Starmer that his uncle was torpedoed during the Falklands War. Today's Prime Minister's question, PMQs, saw Sir Keir grilled over the future of the Falkland Islands following the surrender of the Chagos Islands to Mauritius. Liberal Democrat leader Ed Davey asked the PM to ensure that British citizens, fishing off the Falklands, can sail proudly under the Union Jack. Starmer responded instantaneously, claiming that his uncle had nearly lost his life in Falklands War when his ship was torpedoed defending the Falklands. Starmer reiterated, they are British and they will remain British, it is personal to me, but the remarks left many confused, given that no British ship was torpedoed in the conflict. Only one Argentine ship, the Belgrano, was hit in this way. Number 10 has moved to clarify the comments, insisting that Sir Keir misspoke, having meant to say that his uncle was on board a vessel that was bombed. The Prime Minister's uncle was aboard the British frigate HMS Antelope which was sunk during the conflict to reclaim the islands. Speaking to The Telegraph last year, Starmer lambasted the ferocity of the Argentine bombers, as they targeted ships off of the shore of the islands in a strait that came to be known as Bomb Alley. In the piece and in response to several questions today, the PM praised the extraordinary bravery and sacrifice of our armed forces and vowed that the Falkland Islands will remain under British control.